This is Russ Anderson. A customer recently claimed that tripod saws were broken on Synthize 1806, much to my surprise. As I always do, I asked for a sample scene file to examine, and the customer was kind enough to provide one. It provides some operational lessons that I think everyone can use on their shots. Here's the scene in Synthize 1709. As you can see, it's a very simple made up sample file, so simple it seems nothing could possibly go wrong. We'll solve it here in 1709, and presto, we have a solution. The error is high, but that isn't surprising since it's a made up file, right? Now let's go to Synthize 1806. Again we hit solve, and here Synthize stops with a much higher error. It must be broken, right? Not actually. Behind the scenes, what's happening is that Synthize is being asked to compute the field of view due to the fixed unknown lens mode, but there is insufficient and even contradictory data in this particular scene to determine the field of view. Because the scene doesn't have enough data, Synthize 1709 and 1806 don't have any real guidance on how to improve the scene. So they move very slowly in a direction that might be better. Because the steps are so small, it really never gets anywhere. You can see that the iteration count has reached its limit of 200 in 1806 and 500 in 1709. Even in 1709, it's not reaching an optimal solution. It's giving up. We need to switch to known lens mode, which is the right way to solve this shot, and all other tripod shots where the camera hasn't moved enough and there aren't enough trackers to determine the field of view. In the known mode, you need to specify the field of view, which should be your best guess usually based on other shots from the same project or on-set data. You can pick any value and the scene can't contradict it. You can see that the scene solves instantly in 1806 and in 1709 to the same solution. You might be tempted to stick with 1709 because it appears to provide a solution when 1806 does not but 1709's solution was arbitrary and much worse than any of the solutions that you get in known mode picking any kind of field of view value. So you need to address the actual issue, which is that there's not enough information to determine the field of view. Any quote unquote fix to this in synthize would amount to switching to known mode without it actually knowing the field of view. That's why you, the tracking artist, are here. Digging a bit deeper, when solving the scene in fixed unknown mode, 1806's error is larger because it starts from a randomized position controlled by the first path fuzz setting. On self-consistent shots with enough data, Randomization improves performance and results in somewhat higher quality solutions by reducing systematic errors that occur as it starts to solve. If we set the first path fuzz value to zero and use fixed unknown mode, you see that 1806 produces equivalently bad results to 1709. If we solve in known mode with no fuzz, you get an iteration count around 12. But if we turn the fuzz value on, we get an iteration count around 6. The fuzz value is helpful on good scenes improving performance, giving a better value, depending on the scene. But in marginal scenes, you might want to try turning it off to see if you can pull the field of view value out of a super marginal tripod solve. Just to summarize, you should examine all tripod mode shots 
to see if they're likely to have enough information to solve for the field of view. If not, where you have a higher result, you should switch to the known lens mode using your best estimate for the lens field of view. And you can easily try this both ways. On marginal shots, you can set the fuzz value down to zero and you might have a chance to get a field of view value in adverse circumstances. If you have problems with a shot, please ask for help rather than assuming that it is a program problem. I can't emphasize how important it is to supply sample files. You know, these allow me to address the issues specific to your individual shots and workflow. If there happens to be a program issue or needed improvement, your supplying the scene files allows me to determine that and be able to test any changes that I make as a result. So thanks for watching.